Oh God, this week on the Roman Gazette, we're in uncharacteristically suburban surroundings to investigate a Roman turnpike mystery. So what am I blathering on about? I hear you probably screaming at your devices. What on earth have the 18th century turnpike roads got to do with Roman Britain? Well, let's go and take a look to it. Now, because we're in this much more suburban area, I'm going to be a little covert about this. I don't want this week's vlog turning into an edition of DJ Audits. Now, when the Romans left in 410, everything fell to pieces, a bit like with Brexit. And arguably, it wasn't until the 1700s and the turnpike roads that anyone bothered about the road network in Britain. Tolbar Cottage on the A6 in Cabus, north of Garstang. And this is one of the gateposts remaining on the Tolbar Cottage, a fine example of 18th century craftsmanship. And then over the other side of the road, we'd expect there to be another one of those gateposts, wouldn't we? Now, initially, as you cross and approach the gatepost, it looks as though it might be the same sort of thing. But let's look a bit more closely. As you can see, the gatepost here is very different. And that's because it's actually a Roman milestone. So basically what must have happened when they installed the toll bar, they have picked up the old Roman milestone and used it as a gatepost. I was right, there is a connection between the toll bar, the turnpike road and the Roman milestone and the Roman road that used to run nearby. Until next time, like, subscribe, click the notifications, all that stuff. I'm going to get the bus home now. Stay safe. Do 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 That was quite nerve wracking filming out with such exposure to the general public. So what cut the Roman Empire in half? A pair of Caesars.